In this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to make agar nutrient plates. They're really cheap and easy to make and they can be used for cultivated bacteria, fungus and moulds. And it's really interesting to look at them under the microscope. To do this you're going to need some agar powder which is really easy and cheap to find online and some water. Using the quantities that I am will be enough to make about three agar nutrient plates. However, it's really easy to scale up or down depending on how many you want to make at once. To begin, take 120 millilitres of ordinary water and put it in the saucepan. Put, put the saucepan on a low heat and add one heat teaspoon of agar powder. and stir it in. Keep it on a low heat until all the agar has dissolved and you're left with a solution. Once the agar powder has dissolved you'll be left with a light brown solution. When you get this, pour it into a microwavable pot and put the solution in the microwave until it begins to froth. Oh, that's no good. Okay, now it's plugged in properly. Put put the solution in the microwave in a microwave or bowl and turn it on until it begins to froth. What this is doing is killing all of the bacteria and fungus and viruses, or at least as many as you can. Um, so, but when it's finished, you'll only get the bacteria on there that you want to grow, and it won't be contaminated with anything else. Now it starts to froth, turn it off, take it out. I wait for it to stop frothing. Then put it in again until it begins to froth. Oh. Okay. I don't know if you can see there, but it's frothed. Okay. Do this once more. Okay. Once it's frothed for the third time, you can just pour it into the petri dishes. And this is quite hot. So be careful. Leave these to cool now in the refrigerator for about three to four hours until they've set hard. After spending a couple of hours in the fridge, the agar has got the solution has gone hard. as you can see here. Now, although this wouldn't be much good for actually cultivated bacteria, now I've contaminated it, it does show you that it's gone hard and they're easy and cheap to make compared to buying them already made. Thank you for watching my video tutorial on how to make agar nutrient plates. Please subscribe, comment and like. Thank you very much.